now, where is it to go? Well, now, today, everybody, this is Jordan Jones on my playthrough of Super Mario Galaxy for the Nintendo Wii. If you guys can give me a huge favor and leave a like on this video, I would really appreciate it big time. I'm going to ask you guys this for question of the video. Um, what do you hope is the, um, um, I'm sorry, um, we already did that in the last video. For question of the video, we're going to be doing the kitchen dome next. And there's some really fun galaxy here. We're going to explore a lot. We're gonna do this first. Let's just open all of them. We're doing this first. Since we're going to Beach Ball Galaxy, I just wonder. For question of the video, where is what is your favorite beach you've been to before? What beach have you been to before? My favorite beach I've been to was St. Simon's Island in Georgia. So just let me know in the comments below what your favorite beach is you went to. Um for question of the video since we're at Beach Ball Galaxy. I love Beach Ball Galaxy. This galaxy is so easy, so relaxing, so cool. So exciting. It's pretty cool. Excuse me. All right, we're gonna go underwater. I love swimming. I love being able to swim. Swimming is fun. I love the water levels in video games. I just want to tell you this. Especially in 3D Mario games, though, those water levels are so amazing. Eh, I'm totally weird, but that's okay. We can try again to get that. It doesn't matter what order we get these in. We'll, get, we'll just get them in any order we can. It's not gonna matter. All right, we broke that box. I'm glad we broke the box. Wow! It really feels your air up if you click that? I not realize that. It feels like missions this game are way easier than missions in Galaxy 2. There makes you point straight up right there to move that right there, so what we're gonna do. Wow, this is a really fun galaxy. I like this galaxy. Even if you're not perfect at it, you'll be at every time. That's just how good this, that's just how easy this galaxy is. It's just that easy. That, in order to beat this every time without dying once, you don't even have to be perfect to do that. Because you're a beginner and probably not going to be perfect at it. Alright. Alright, let's ground pound here. This game's a really fun game. This goal needs to be on the easy side, and that's okay. Because I just don't want games to be too difficult. But this game's pretty easy. So I'm okay with it being easy. Because there's not really many levels that ever get me. So I'm just gonna focus here. Use that homemade ground pound to ground pound that. My, which is one of my favorite moves to do in this game. We'll try to do at least two or three stars an episode. Cause these stars, are, some stars are super easy to get really quickly. So we use that same move here. Wow. The way we're going to be collecting our stars is backflip into the star like we always do. Wow, that was a really easy star. Did Rosalina's storybook open? I think Rosalina's storybook opened. <coughs> Excuse me. I'll show that at the end of the playthrough about Rosalina's storybook because 
first story deck is awesome. Alright, we're gonna do the second star here. And that is passing the swing test. And this one is the easiest star in the game. In my opinion, it's the easiest star in the game. Let me know. For a second question of the video, let me know what's the easiest star you ever got in the game. I'd love to know. Since most of these stars are fairly easy, I know. It's kind of funny, I'm asking you guys this on the easy video game. Alright, I'm not going to read all these to you guys. I'll just read special ones to you. So we can find these guys pretty easily. Sometimes it might take longer than others, but that's okay. This level is definitely doable. <laughs> definitely. I just noticed that. Alright, we found them. Now, they were, they're easy to find. It wasn't that hard to find at all. Alright, alright, penguin. Alright. Wow, wow, this is a really easy star. Like I said, this is the easiest star in the game, in my opinion. You can pretty much speedrun this. If you're lucky, you can speedrun it. Because you can easily learn patterns easily in this game and just memorize how to do it. So. Excuse me. I think we're gonna do the Bubble Breeze Galaxy next, cause it also reminds me of the beach. So let's... We're discovering enemy base in the region. If you can only hope they are not missing, misusing the power of that poor Grand Star. Do this next. Bubble for his galaxy. Let's see how we do at it. Throw the poison swamp. Hopefully I'll do pretty well in this galaxy. Right, it's just teaching us how to ride in the bubbles. I'm just gonna focus here and be quiet. This is a pretty cool galaxy. I mean, it's not one of my favorites or anything, but it's cool. The music's so relaxing. We're gonna be careful. Be careful. If you hit any of the spots, you'll fall and die. So be careful when you play this. I'm not saying this level's super difficult or anything, but. Slow and steady wins the race. This level goes slow as you want to. Don't 
most important thing to tell you is don't go too fast. Because if you're too fast, you'll probably die. That would increase the likelihood of dying if you go too fast. There we go. Blast off! What's the name of this galaxy? Alright, Bubble Breeze Galaxy. Okay. I sometimes don't even memorize all the names of the galaxies. I can't memorize all the names of them. I can memorize how to beat them. Oh, yeah, but... I just can't memorize all the names. That's the only thing about them I cannot memorize. Alright. This reminds me of like a Wii Fit Plus thing we did on Wii Fit and stuff. That's what this level really reminds me of. That's why I think it's cool, but at the same time, it's like, eh. We're not going to collect that right there because it's not very important to collect a lot of star bits. The most important thing is just as long as we can get to the level we can use it. As long as we don't die. That's all that matters. Take your time, that's all you gotta do. A lot of people complain about this mission being difficult, but honestly it's not too difficult for me at least. I used to have a hard time with it, but now... If you think... If you disagree with me and think this one's difficult, it's okay. Slow and steady wins the race. <laughs> Darn it, we got hit. That's okay, it does not matter. Let's collect our star. It's not that difficult for me. It's not that difficult for me, honestly. That's the last star we're gonna do in this episode. All right, guys. Thank, thank you very much for watching. Have a good one. And next time, we'll see which ones we'll do next time. Uh, we'll just do the third star of this one next time, and we'll probably do the hidden star of this one, and then probably the first one of this one, or unless we get this unlocked somehow. Thank you very much for watching. Have a good one. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.